Hey, hello everyone. I think I'm having problems with some strange red rain. I don't even know what to do. Wow, is that Mikey wondering what he needs in this weather? Really wondering why he's so scared. JJ, we have problems. I was reading the news now and you know what it says. They said that during this terrible blood rain, zombies will wake up and start walking around the villages. My God, what should we do? I have an idea JJ urgently need to build bunkers to protect us from these monsters, otherwise they will eat us. I have a stone and there is a lot of wood. I will build a bunker from these elements. <laughs> Mikey, do you think this will help your whole bunker will break down if there are a lot of zombies your bunker just won't hold up? What's funny, JJ? This will be the strongest bunker. I'm very interested in what you're going to make your bunker out of. I will build a bunker out of gold. They will definitely not be able to destroy it, and I will put iron doors for myself so that no one can get into my house. Yeah, I think Mikey will get a very bad bunker, and it will be broken right away. Now we'll see who will stand the strongest bunker. I think my bunker will be much better than Mikey's bunker. I hope his bunker can withstand an attack. Ha ha ha. I'm very interested in what he will do. Let's start building. I have all the necessary tools. Well, let's start building our best bunker in the world. I can't wait to see how it will look. I imagine Mikey's face when he sees it. From the beginning, we need to make a pit, and from there I will expand the walls of my bunker. It will take a lot of effort, and a lot of time will also be spent, but it will be worth it. I really want there to be enough space in my bunker for two people in case Mikey fails, and his bunker just collapses. It's good that I thought about it, otherwise Mikey would have huge problems, then he would just be eaten. Somehow it's hard, a lot of work, but I will try, and I will not stop no matter how much effort I spend on it. But I need to survive. I will build walls of gold blocks so that they cannot break through my walls and my doors with their powerful blows. I will make the door out of the strongest steel. Meanwhile, I have almost finished expanding my bunker. The walls are getting further and further away. I will need to equip my bunker so that it would be very cozy in it. No one knows how long it will last and how many zombies there will probably be a lot of them. I hope that the residents also started building their shelters. Well, dear friends, so I finished expanding the walls and it remains only to finish them from gold blocks. I wonder how Mike is doing there. I urgently need to go check it out. I don't want him to see me. I won't go in noticeably and observe what he really makes his bunker out of. I'm very interested after which I will continue building my bunker. I don't need to rest much because I'm very tired. Mm. <gasps> Ooh. Yep. Hmm, it seems that Mikey is very interested in building his bunker and is very surprised. But how bad it looks just some pieces of wood that are not clear. Well, good luck, Mikey. Make your strong bunker. I will also continue building a lot more. Things need to be finished as soon as possible. I think you will also like the look of my bunker. How I like to build my beautiful bunker. It will be much better and stronger than JJ's. He thinks that he can do better than me but we'll see and draw conclusions about who builds better bunkers. I will be a promoter. Ha ha ha. Mikey thinks that he will do better than me. He probably did not quite understand correctly. I'm really going to make a bunker completely out of gold. He will come when his bunker falls apart and see who is better and more comfortable. He thinks that he will get something good out of low quality materials. Look for yourself. I have a lot of gold blocks and I don't even need them. So I decided to make walls out of these blocks. I think I can afford it. Gold is very durable, so I don't worry about my safety, but for the safety of Mikey, I really wonder if he can survive. But we'll see. Hey, hey guys, look what I did. I just couldn't take my eyes off. I finished making walls and made a floor out of soft rubber so that it would be more pleasant to be here. You can lie right on the floor and keep warm well, and I'm very cozy and comfortable here. I need to go to Mikey and see how he's doing there. It's been a very long time. Maybe he changed something in his building. Oh, JJ, hi. I thought you weren't coming anymore. Come here and see what kind of bunker I have. I really like it here. Just close the doors. It seems to me that the zombies have already started their hunt. My God, what is this, Mikey? It looks very bad. There is absolutely no place here, and these wooden blocks will not stand if there are a lot of zombies. I immediately invite you to live with me. Your bunker is very bad. It is not possible to survive in it. It feels like an old grandmother is surviving here. What are you talking about, JJ? You think that your bunker is the best? My bunker will withstand any onslaught of zombies you will see for yourself if you don't like it? Then you can go to you. 
I won't come here. I will be much better. And I am sure that it is the strongest bunker in the whole world. Mikey, I really hope so. But it seems to me that it won't help you survive. They'll just break down your bunker and get inside. It's not safe at all. But if anything, you can come to me and I won't mind. I don't want you to be eaten by zombies or worse. Turned into the same as their very dangerous Mikey. I am very grateful to you that you want to help me. But it seems to me that you envy me very much. So you say that I would redo my wonderful bunker into some kind of not beautiful no JJ. I will not redo anything. Everything is fine with Yeah, Mikey is very stubborn and doesn't want to change anything. Well, I'll start setting up my bunker because I have a zombie under my door. It's very bad if he breaks my wooden door. You need to make them out of metal as soon as possible before there are even more of them. These doors are made of durable steel that has been specially tempered for such cases. Yes, that's how I really like the way these doors look. They look very durable. That's how great it is now. For sure, no one will be able to enter my house, but just in case I made a bunker, suddenly someone will be able to enter my house. And in the meantime, we need to start setting up because most likely I'm moving into it since the zombies have already come to me and probably they have already taken over the whole, the village in my chest. There is everything that is necessary for survival, a refrigerator, a computer, and all that. You need to adjust the light so that it would be very cozy here, and everything would be clearly visible. A table, and you need to put a computer on it so that I can play and watch different videos from Mikey and JJ. A TV and a sofa so that you can play Xbox. It looks very good. You can hear the sounds. There are already a lot of zombies there. They are trying to break down my armored door, but I need to go up to the house to pick up a couple more details. Hmm, it's strange why there are so many zombies there. Very scary sounds are being made. I hope that Mikey is doing well and his bunker is in order. Now you need to put a computer in order to have something to do. You definitely need to put simulators in order to maintain physical readings in the norm. I think this is a good idea. I'm finally done, I'm very tired, but I really like my bunker. I'm so happy that I'm completely safe at a time like this, but I'm very worried about Mikey. I hope everything is okay. Oh, oh, what is it, these zombies? How could they get here? They are breaking my bunker. JJ was right, I urgently need to run to him or they will eat me. Ah, my house and my bunker are finished. Hmm. What are those sounds of someone knocking on my door? It's definitely not a zombie. It's probably Mikey that needs to be looked at urgently. Wow, what happened? Jay, you were right. My bunker was destroyed and my house is over. I can hide with you. I'm sorry that I didn't listen to you. Of course, Mikey. I'm glad to see you come into my bunker. You'll really like it here. Wow, Jay, Jay, you have so cool here. I really like it. You have everything you need for a comfortable stay. I really like it here. There is even a simulator. Thank you for taking care of us. You are a real friend. I am very glad that you liked it in my bunker. Now it is our bunker, and here we will survive anything from you. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.